Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpisami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpisami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Greetings everybody guys today. Again we'll take a look at the Eurocouncil, let's see what has happened here in yesterday's session. So as you can see this was not really a lot of activity on the market. Uh, let's see what what new inputs we have here. So first of all on daily chart guys we have two side by side bullish grubbers. But uh, these grubbers uh, that we have um, Guys, actually, I have real doubts about it. At least I need some more confirmation on uh, on its activity, on its um, if efficiency. Because take a look, watch this. I will show you the, the dollar index chart, and you can see that dollar index has the same grabbers, and today has not been closed yet. But yesterday we've got another one, and take a look. It all it shows it, it points in the opposite direction. So the dollar index suggests uh, here upper direction, while euro currencies also suggest upper direction. So they stand contradicted to each other. It tells us that's not really very reliable. Besides, if you will take a look at the extreme points of these grubbers, they bring nothing new to our analysis that we have made in the weekend, because um, you can see that extreme points of these grubbers. So if market will either break these laws, it will destroy these grubbers and suggest to break out of our ra range that we have discussed in the vehicle research or if market will start up protection here and will break this top and so on intraday charts this also will confirm this possible upward continuation but currently guys uh, by some um, some price behavior that I see on the intraday charts makes me have real doubts on the perspective of the upward continuation in the ever comes in the nearest future maybe yes somewhere a bit later uh, maybe on next week, when closer to the end of this week, market could turn up. But uh, currently, I suspect that we should get at least another leg down first. Maybe this will not be some crucial breakout of the support area and downward continuation. Maybe not. But some some kind of downward continuation we, we should get. Uh, here, what I see. So on the four-hour time frame chart, this is our the same area. So we said that this will be very important for us. The BC range between the B and C point of our former A, B, C, D passion, right? Why this is important? Because here we have two, so we could call it contradictive patterns are, are forming. So first is the reverse head and shoulders, as you can see here. It's a bit skewed here, uh, with this upward continuation, but on the dollar index, it could be seen better. So we, we already have talked about it. Now a vehicle research. Second, we have the direct head and shoulders on the hourly chart that it points in opposite direction. Now, what's really interesting is that take a look at this price action. If you would suggest the upside continuation after the retracement, right? So it's forming of the right arm of the hand shoulders pattern. If you suggest the upward continuation, whether you will be happy with this kind of price behavior when the market already should turn up and starting upward continuation. This price behavior mostly looks like kind of the ABCD retracement after this drop. That's why this price action stands mostly in favor of this pattern, of the hourly hand chart. So I'll take a look at the hourly chart. This is the pattern that we have discussed in our weekly research. Take a look what we've got. It's definitely not kind of frosting action. It's definitely not the impulse action. This mostly takes a look at the retracement. Um, after this drop, and this mostly um, stands in favor of this patient. On the dollar index, guys, it, it could be seen even better. So if we'll take a look at the four-hour chart of the dollar index. This is hourly chart. You will see that it's um, just we'll erase these lines. So you can see that uh, actually, when if when market forms. Uh, the, 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 the after the world has formed the top of the right shoulder and starting this kind of action, it's uh, not normal. So when, when the left shoulder is forming, you need to see faster action down. This is kind of the step 
down action it's mostly like the retracement after this rally that's why for me now this pattern stands less reliable than last week when we saw just reaching of this top and it was really a chance to create the uh, hand shoulders here uh, correspondingly on the hourly chart guys this price action gradual retracement down mostly stands in favor of upward continuation because this is after the rally market shows gradual step down uh, two step forward one step back retracement right right, right now as you can see market stands uh, where's my line here it is so market stays precisely as you can see at the bottom of the left shoulder so it has been hit that's why here uh, it's a very important moment whether market indeed will continue move higher on dollar rings and corresponding on the euro currency whether it will continue move down so currently guys personally I do not want to rely on the daily grabbers because for they, they, they are not confirmed by uh, dollar index because dollar index as I said shows the same grabbers but in opposite direction and overall price behavior that they see on the intraday charts also makes me really feel some doubts on the on, on the perspective of the upward continuation on the um, euro currency immediately that's why I think that we still keep an, should keep an eye on the, um, the same range that we have discussed and watch today for CPI report so market will expect approximately 1.8 percent this is uh, the average expectation so we will see some great inflation core CPI I mean um, well that will be supportive for the dollar um, so that being said although we don't have the breakout either to the upside nor to the downside but overall price behavior, behavior makes me think that um, it seems the chance on the downward continuation stands a bit greater than the immediate upward continuation so that's just what I see right now but uh, anyway we need to get the final confirmation as we said from the market